Hello students, this is J Science Hub. Today we are going to study about cell theory. By watching this video, you will get some understanding about cell, cell theory and the scientists who are connected with the cell theory. Cell theory is considered as a core theory in the field of biology. Okay, before entering into the topic, you should know some basic information about cell. Cell is considered as a fundamental unit of any organism. There are two types of cells. One is prokaryotic cell and other one is eukaryotic cell. Prokaryotic cells are the primitive cells while eukaryotic cells are the advanced cells. Eukaryotic cell is made up of multiple organelles which bounded by membrane. There is a fixed nucleus presence in eukaryotic cell. Inside it has DNA. Plant and animal cells are the example of eukaryotic cell. Prokaryotic cells are the primitive cells. They have a simple structure and they are not having a fixed nucleus. They have coiled DNA which we call as nucleoid. Bacteria is an example of prokaryotic cell. Okay, now let's see the cell theory. All living organisms are composed of cells. They may be unicellular or multicellular. The cell is the basic unit of life. Cells arise from pre-existing cell. They are not derived from spontaneous generation. There are five scientists related to cell theory. Two of them put the basic foundation for the formation of cell theory. Rest three make the cell theory. Robert Cook is the scientist first observed the cell. While he observed a cork through his microscope, he found chamber-like structure and he is the first one name it as cell. Anton van Leeuwenhoek is an expert in making lenses. He is considered as an expert at his time for making different microscopes that are more advanced at that time. By using the microscopes he made, he observed different organisms. He observed several microorganisms, that's why we consider him as the father of microbiology in honor for his valuable services. The three scientists who made the cell theory are Jacob Sheldon, Theodor Schwann and Rudolf Weishaupt. Usually your history teacher taught you that Germans are bad guys because they caused the world wars. But all these three scientists are comes from Germany. Jacob Schegelden is a botanist. By his experiment on plants, he identified that plants are made up of basic unit called cells. Theodor Schwann is a zoologist. He made experiments on animals. Along with the experiments made by Jacob Schegelden, he came to the conclusion and said all the organisms are made up of cells. The third person is Rudolf Virchow. He comes with a special idea and he states the new cells are formed from the old cells.